From the FDA to the World Health Organization, overuse of antibiotics is a major topic of discussion. Overusing antibiotics is becoming a global problem, and because of this, it's becoming difficult to treat some germs. The more that these bugs get exposed to an antibiotic, they get smart and they get resistant. According to the Adair County Health Department's 2012 annual report, it did more than 200 clinical services for gonorrhea and chlamydia. Gonorrhea has progressively developed resistance to the antibiotic drugs prescribed to treat it. Just last summer, the uh, CDC has come out with recent recommendations that because the bugs are getting smarter, we need to use two antibiotics now. So that if someone is diagnosed with gonorrhea, and there's over 800,000 cases a year in America, um, fear not, there are still antibiotics to treat, but over the long term, we're going to have to stay one page ahead of them and develop new antibiotics to kill the germ. The CDC says additional contributing factors include incorrect diagnosis of the disease or unnecessary prescriptions. The gonorrhea story is just another chapter of the same book. We're finding that because of several reasons, overuse of antibiotics in the human population, some people say overuse in the agricultural population, either to promote growth in animals or to keep away infection. We're finding that some of the common germs that we see in human infections are becoming resistant to multiple antibiotics, and sometimes even to the very powerful, strong antibiotics, so that everything from tuberculosis to staph, and yes, even with some sexually transmitted diseases, we may see the day where, and in fact it is here, where we're seeing superbugs that are resistant to everything, and that can be tragic with sometimes fatal results. Monisha Bruner, KTVO News.